Hey, what's up guys? It's Pat and welcome back to Evil Minecraft. And today we're going to continue on exploring in these caves and hopefully find some more diamonds for gear. Because we're really going to need it against the infernal mobs. I feel like without it we're probably going to die. Do I hear a mob? Oh, skeleton. Let me just put that right there. Oh, don't even try to climb over there. <laughs> Hold on, I'm going to use this to my advantage. And hit him in the feet. Okay, there's multiple mobs. Are you stuck in the wall? Kind of look like you are. But yeah, guys, I feel like we need a little bit more gear before we should head out of here. So we actually have, like, a nice advantage. Because there's going to be some tough mobs. It's going to be intense in this series. We haven't really seen... Ow! I okay, never mind. It didn't hurt that much because I took no damage. Um, I need one more hit on you. There we go. All right, can I make it through yet? I think I want to continue down, though. Um, skeleton. Damn it, there's so many. All right, come. If you must. I will hit you in the feet just like I did your friends. Where are you? Come back here. Don't be afraid. The problem is so much stuff spawns, and one of the mods actually ups the spawn cap to a higher amount. Where the hell did he go? Did he die? No, he didn't. He's right there. Okay, so what I can do is I can just break this one off and probably just fight him right from here. Probably be easier. All right, I've got him. You try to escape this. And give me your bow. Did you drop the bow now? Damn it, I really want a bow. It's going to be so useful in this series. Another... Oh my god, do I even want to go further down here? I want to go back to the house, work on our base a little bit before I get down to this hellhole again. Ow! Okay, taking damage now. Jesus. All right, there are so many mobs. All right, come on, skeleton. All right, is it safe yet? Here comes a couple more zombies. Oh, wow. Okay, just, you know what? Come in here. Let's go. Come on, bro. Come on. Come on. You ain't gonna make it through. All right. Anything? Oh, my God. This is ridiculous. Okay, this is bad. Please drop him. I deserve a bow. Hello, Enderman. What the hell? The whole... The whole world is coming through here. Got a bone in his hand. I'm not looking at any Enderman. He, puts, he grabs the block. Yeah, I don't know if we should continue down here. I think it's time to leave for now. We'll come back another day when there isn't a million mobs. Or a different cave that seems to be a little bit safer. How dangerous is this place? Should I give it another shot? Should I keep going? I hear something is my issue. Enderman, friend. Oh my god. Hit the Enderman, not me. Hit him. He wants to fight. Not I. Okay, no rare spawns, though, I, I guess. This is good. Let's go. Come on. Give me your bow, please. Zombie? Yeah, there's so many. It's, it's ridiculous. I'm out of here. I'm out of here for now. We'll get back down into a mine another day. I don't want to spend the whole time just trying to get through here and ending out probably dying at the end. That's gonna how that's how it's gonna be. I really feel like it is. I think I need to get down quicker. I need more torches so we can really light things up, and I just don't have enough left anymore. So I believe this is the way out. <laughs> yeah, we'll get more torches for next time we go down into a mine. Yeah, this looks really safe, by the way. What's up, zombie? <laughs> Going down the water slide, I see. Alright, at least we have enough for an enchantment table too. That's gonna help with our gear. What the hell? What the hell is going on here? Let me out of this. Alright, I think we're safe to go now. Let me out of this cave. We must swim out. And you can see I pretty much lit it up. I think we could get down deeper, but the thing is with only seven torches, I think it's going to be too dark. And I'm going to see like 10 million monsters on the way. It'll be way too difficult. We'll probably die. And I don't want to make my golden apple yet. I'm, I'm saving it. I've taken some damage here. Need to get back up, work on the base, get some apples. <laughs> get everything perfect. Alright, I hear a mob, obviously. It's really freaking dark right here. Oh, what's up, bro? What's up? Come on, let's go. Let's go. I have plenty of iron. I can make more iron stuff, too. Other side of me? No? Okay, good. Just fall down. Okay, he's gone. Say bye to him. Alright, how the hell do we get out of here? We need to get out of here really quick. Really quick. Alright, looks so... I don't know which way to go. I really need a spot to just sit for a second and think. 
I mean, I see the way out, actually. This way. Let's go. I can't even run. It's nighttime. Worst time ever. Actually, hold on. Out of my way. I know, I'm hitting him with the wrong weapon. Let me somewhere... You really need to get somewhere safe. This is, this is for safety right here. Put down. Okay. Okay, we can get out of here. I need some food, obviously. You probably can tell. <laughs> Even the stealth things are dangerous. Like, the amount of mobs coming are so much higher than they normally would be. I'm actually going to dig out of here like, like a pro right now. Digging out. We could actually get some more stone this way for building our house. Which is probably a good thing, so maybe maybe it's good that I'm doing this. Let's get the hell out of here. I see the dirt. We must be near the surface. I have four more torches to use. And nothing should be able to get us through here. I did totally just forget about it until now, but the meteorites could easily be coming. And actually have crashed down. But we'll find out when we get out of here. I hate this mixture of dirt and, and stone. It makes things confusing. Just trying to get out of here. Let me out of this place. I think it was too dangerous to go through the cave to actually get out. Oh, I found the surface. Spider, I need string. I need to make a bow. Come back. All right, run. Run. We must get out of here. All right, there aren't really any mobs around. That's good. Spider that I really want to kill. They need a good spot to do this from. Alright, spider. Let's go. I need the string really bad. Ow! I'm not very good at fighting these. Alright, I got some string. I got two. That's perfect. So we need this for the bow. I really need to get to my house. As you could probably imagine. He's a rare zombie. We need to get the hell out of here. Rare zombie. He's gonna kill me. Oh my god, he shot a fireball at me! Oh my god, Annie has the wither effect. That that is terrible. We, we must go now. To the house. Another spider. All right. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Got ya. All right. Just barely. I have enough for a bow, too. Oh, my God. Where's my bed? I need to, get, I need to take out. I need to make a bed. I, I don't know what to do. See a skeleton up there. All right. <laughs> I need to get to the top of this mountain. All right, I hear him walking around. What we need to do is this. Let me put this down. Oh, my God. Run. Run. Towards the water. All right, across the water. I see a creeper waiting there. This is going to be so difficult. Get me in here. Don't kill me. Oh, man. How often do I end out in these situations? All right, yeah, it's, it's dark. I know. I, I know it's dark. I'm going to leave a little spot open right there so you can see. So what I'm going to do is... <laughs> I'm in such a bad spot here. All right, so I'm actually... I need wood. Oh, man, if I want to make a bed, I need wood. Okay. So what we're going to do is we are going to get out of here. We only have one. I could smell this stuff. I don't want to do that right now. So let me get my axe into position here. I hear a skeleton coming, and you can see the zombies actually working together as a team to try to get to me. Like, they do go around like that in, like, hordes of them. I killed the skeleton, and look how many there are. They're all, like, they're all swimming together. They actually look like they're having a good time over there. Let me just wait for this next skeleton. Okay, well, if we do die, I'm just throwing this out there. We will respawn in our house, and we will um, be able to get our stuff pretty easily, I think. It's ridiculous. I'm getting out of here after I kill these two. We are trapped. Rare spawn. This is this is game. Yeah. That, rare spawn. Let me on fire. All right. Go to sleep. Oh, thank God. All right. We can get our stuff, guys. I really hope that burning on fire really didn't hinder us being able to get our stuff, though. We'll see. We're going to head back right now. See a creeper over there. Oh, my God. Was that dangerous? So yeah, if you couldn't tell until now, this series is really dangerous. I know I haven't encountered too much until today. But um, yeah, dangerous series. Definitely. <laughs> We're going to head down and try to get our stuff back, which should be able to, I think. I'll be very upset if we can't. Alright, so it was... um, Where the hell was it? <laughs> it was around the water. 
I don't know if this was the water, though. All right, I'll find it. Don't worry. It's probably just further around. All right, I went down the wrong side. I'm not sure. I think I did, to be honest. I heard the creeper exploding, and I've avoided it. Actually, it's right over there. There's where it is, I think. Okay, we're gonna be okay. We're gonna be okay. Um, I just need to get my stuff. I mean, that's a spot where we killed those sheep that time, right? And there's my stuff. There we go. There we go. Thank God for that. All right, I still need to break this block. My pickaxe is in there. Give me my pickaxe back. Oh my God. Please break. There we go. Okay, so all my stuff is right here. And we look to be pretty sad. We get this on. Get this on. Get this on. My chest. Why my chest plate? I have an egg. This is what I don't need. No chicken? Okay. Oh, I know I can right click it on. But yeah, we've got our full gear. We've got our emeralds, our diamonds, our pickaxe. I don't think we lost anything here. Thank God. Yeah, we died. I, <laughs> I knew it was going to happen. So that, our first death. And it was a gruesome one. Rare spawns. Just so much going on, making it extremely difficult. That's the reason I was hoping to get diamond gear, but there was just there was just too much going on down there for today. So, actually, while we're down here, while we are down here, I probably should get more wood. And when we get up there, I am going to plant some trees. Gonna need to get my um, farm going. And I need to make the house safer for the next night, because it's really terribly scary at night. As you could tell. So look at all this. It's going pretty good. I've got 10 wood. One death. Not too bad. And that is the reason I didn't do hardcore. If anyone was like, Pat should have done hardcore. Yeah, I, impossible. Impossible. Those mobs light you on fire. I'm not even, I barely even touch them. I'm hiding behind something and I get killed. Alright, so this should be a good amount of wood. To at least get us started. Alright, let me grab this. Oh, I am missing inventory space, aren't I? What do I not need? Really don't need badly at all. Try to see. Something that's really unimportant. The most unimportant thing is probably this dirt. So give me all this stuff. And we are going to head up towards my home. And I am going to start working on it. Alright, so I need to find my way back up here. I need to get like a better way to get up and down than I have right now. Because right now it's not very good. I'm glad we were pretty successful in the cave though. I have a lot of iron... Um, I also have a lot of gold, so we can actually make golden apples and stuff like that. A little zombie fish. I'll take anything at this point. <laughs> Give me anything. Yeah, I ran out of wood. That was a problem. So I'm going to make sure I have more wood on me from now on. And I'm not going to be using keep inventory. I was able to get my stuff back anyway, which is really good. Because I had some pretty damn good stuff on me. And luckily, I died pretty close to our home here. So yeah, the home, it needs to get redone completely. And do I have um, saplings on me right now? Yeah, I do. So I'm going to plant these out here. It's daytime. It's probably a good time to do this. So one there, one there, one there. And I'll plant a couple over here. So that way we'll have plenty of wood we can get. We're going to need it. So I need to come up with a very safe way for my house. Which I'm going to try to figure out. I'm going to have to use some kind of like moat or something. And a lot of people suggested building it into the air, which I think is a great suggestion. I really do. I think it's brilliant. So I may do that. I may just have an entrance to it. Like this. And if somehow the zombies get in there, then that sucks. But have a way up. I feel like we should go higher into the air. I mean, they, they're not going to be able to get up here. I'm going to make some kind of ladder system. Or something. <laughs> we'll see. But yeah, let's see. Um, I need to put down my furnaces. And get some stuff smelting for now. I'll try to work on my house probably next episode. And get this like really safe. Maybe set up some defenses. Alright so I'll put in my gold ore. Gonna need that. And I'm also going to smelt my iron. Which should be awesome. And this. I feel like birch. Different color right? So possibly floor. Floor color. <laughs> Why not make a floor for our home? I know, it's, it's about survival, but if my all oh, my house is the same color, it'll look way too plain. And now we can actually get ourselves an iron door, which really kind of need that badly. Alright, so we haven't seen any meteorites strike down. I believe they can strike within 200 meters of you. I think that's how it's set on default. Meaning they're going to literally come from the sky 
and it's got to be near three days and that means they could come at any time but they may have already came and just be a little bit further away so we'll see as we explore the land around us see what happens here all right so um am i out of birch that all i had okay so i'm gonna try to redo the floor i'm gonna get all this stuff growing here maybe even get some more trees there's also a nice jungle over there which is awesome there could be a jungle temple Okay, so my gold... Does my, do I still have my apple? I still do. Alright, so I've got six of these. And that should be enough for... Let's make a door. Really gonna need an iron door here. I feel like if I need to do something today for the house, it's probably my iron door. So I've got an iron door. And that should replace this one. So I guess we're gonna use a button since zombies, you know, they can't use buttons. So I'll put it right there. I hate buttons. I hate them because they're so annoying. They're annoying. You have to admit it that they're kind of annoying because sometimes you like miss you don't do it quick enough and <laughs> The damn thing stops. I hate it. All right, so I got another button for this side and now We've got a door to our house that we can actually use. Thank God. All right, so it's somewhat safe in here except for the you know No ceiling thing So let me at least finish this off. All right guys, so all the iron is finally finished so what we're gonna do is I'm gonna work on this house. I'm gonna set up some kind of defenses to it next time. See, I fail at these. I fail at buttons. I hate buttons so much. <laughs> but I'm gonna need it. I'm gonna set up some kind of defensive house here. Maybe even build it into the air to make it safer and have this just kind of be the entrance and then have like a way up where nothing could really get me at all. <laughs> but yeah, we're out of the cave for now. It was just way too freaking dangerous. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, I'd really appreciate it if you left a like and subscribed. Thanks for watching. I will see you next time.